Obviously, what Josh does in the pool is incredible, but I get the sense that you two care more about who he is as a human that is the than, job. than any of his accomplishments. 100%, 100%. When somebody come up to me and say, your son is awesome, tell me he's an awesome human being before you tell me he's an awesome swimmer. For me, I've been, I think one of my strengths would be, I would say like learning, like learning from mistakes or even like successes. I think that's why it's been, I've been able to, to get better is because like I'm always willing to, willing to learn and that's definitely a product of them. <laughs> when we took him to the pool, the, the, it was a baby pool, the coach was say, huh, this, look at the other kids, they were crying and screaming. And he was like having fun with the water. The coach was like, this is the only kid who's not afraid of the water. He knows what he wants to do. You know, one thing is to, is to see people speaking about their dreams, and the other is to raise one. When you have a child telling you, I'm gonna do this, and talk to you, it didn't work out, but when you see him walking and the Olympic rigs behind him, and, and you remember the moment when he told you that, it's unbelievable. <laughs> I need to, I need to internalize this. Sophia. What do you think of all of this? It's just so nice to see that people like love and appreciate him as much as as we do. You know how like he's down there and all the kids are like, Josh, Josh. They're throwing boards at him, signing, <laughs> <laughs> signing. There was this one black kid and he went straight for him and he gave him like a he gave him like a dab a handshake. Mm, yeah. And um, I cried like when I when I saw that because I thought like, you know, when he was on me like you know. <laughs> when he was coming up, like there was no one to do that for him. It was not something I, I thought about a lot when, when we were in the Caribbean, but then when when you come here it's like it's it's brought up a lot. So you start thinking about it right as a young kid and I would be lying if I said there was times where I didn't question if I could make it as far as I did just because of kind of outside influence. And like I always get asked the question like, oh, do you have any idols in the sport? And like the answer is like, no, I never had any idol in, in swimming. Like there's never anyone that I could say like I identified with, right? Or that I found myself similar with. I had to look to, to like other sports for role models, but it's definitely, you know, thanks to you guys um, and the, the way you've raised me, raised us. I'm glad that people can kind of see the product of what you guys did. I've had an overwhelming support. I've been helped by so many people to be able to get where I am today. So it's by no means just my success. It's more than me. Feed the Dream by Sobeys, official grocer of Team Canada.